Hi everybody, I am Thomas from Virginia Outdoors Unlimited and this morning we are going to be doing some duck hunting. I'm actually out here in some kind of unfamiliar territory this morning. Came a little bit uh, further east of where I typically hunt. We're only about 5 to 10 miles from the Chesapeake Bay right now. But I uh, came out here to a swamp that my buddy Eli has permission on. He joined us for our goose float this September and I also think he was in a dove hunting video so uh, Drew is with us as well they came out here together last weekend and shot a black duck and a woody apiece so uh, they have a little bit more history hunting this this is my first time even even stepping foot in this swamp uh, what we're gonna be in this morning is a big beaver swamp or actually a really big beaver swamp uh, we're just kind of gonna set up right in the middle of it uh, I think typically they have quite a few woodies buzzing around here and then there's always the opportunity for big ducks uh, so would really love to get a black duck today. I've only got one this season, only two actually in my life. So uh, getting another black duck would be nice. Uh, definitely have the opportunity here. Not much else to say weather wise. We have partially cloudy conditions. We do have like a nice 10 mile per hour wind today. So hopefully that'll help uh, with the birds behaving. And uh, yeah, looking forward to this. So stay tuned. All right, sh shooting time. Those were definitely, I think those were blacks. They were dark. Black ducks. Did you shoot at that one that just... Okay, I got the one behind us then. Damn, oh man, I did not think those were gonna hook. That was nice. I took the top of that tree off. I'm gonna go pick up mine. Eli's the one on duty. Drake? It's the bill. If the bill's yellow, it's a Drake. If it's olive, it's a hen. Still a pre bird. The other one should be prettier then. Yeah. Did y'all have? Did y'all just kill a pair last time? Because last yeah. time they were both drakes. One was a juvenile. Oh, pretty bird there, man. Some of my absolute favorites. Gosh, every time I hold one, I just become more impressed with them. Pure one too. No white above the wing, so that indicates a pure black duck. Nice, pretty bird there. Let's sit back down. Oh, sh wow. Holy cow, Eli. <laughs> that is a brute. Look at the head on him. Oh my. Oh my gosh, look at him now. That is a brute of a black duck. I'll have to compare him to the hen, but oh my lord. Go ahead and put them on the beaver dam. Here he comes. Everybody just shoot one. I got it. All right. We just had some roosted geese come out of there. We had heard them when we were walking in and we thought they had gone the other way or I don't know, something. And they came over and each of us got our one goose. Unfortunately, we're in the AP zone here, so one goose limit, but uh, I think we got three. One's over there, and there should be two right here. Is it? You all right? Nope. Ha ha, I'm wet now. Yeah. You got anything in your pocket you need? <sighs> just my wallet. You right? Yeah, just cold. Whew. Just cold. 
All right, I'm gonna go pick up this one over here and then I'm gonna work the shore going down. Drew, did where you picked up this one right here though, where Eli is though, right? Yeah. yeah. No, I okay. Oh, big old fat swamp goose there. Oh gosh, just no luck today with the walking. Holy cow, that sucked. Ugh. Well, I made it all the way down here to the end of the beaver swamp. Here's the main dam. We shot those birds probably 150 yards up there. And I worked this whole shoreline down, looking all out in the swamp. I guess this goose might have might have run off on me. They will do that. They'll get in these woods and take off if they hear or see you coming. So disappointing. Those were some pretty decent shot opportunities. I mean, still 35, 30 yard shots as they peeled off, but very killable. Nice pair of black ducks here this morning. Uh, beautiful birds. I wanted to just hold them like this to kind of show off the size comparison between the drake and the hen. Those drakes do get much much bigger than the hens beautiful birds though and then we also ended with a couple fat old geese and lost our third one unfortunately right around 8 30 now and we are going to go ahead and call it a day uh honestly there wasn't a ton of movement after the first flight we saw a couple woodies but they just didn't cooperate this morning we were expecting if we were going to shoot some birds it was going to be predominantly woodies and they just went on a different path than they typically do i uh, did see a few black ducks had those two commit which was always pretty to have that happen and then uh, the geese were a nice little mid-morning surprise we heard them when we came in and then basically heard them honk like one time right before they popped up and they tried to come out of the swamp and uh, that did not end well for them i think they basically it was too thick for them on the back end of the swamp so this was really their only uh, entrance and exit to that hole that they were roosted back in but uh yeah nice little morning thanks to eli for having me out here nice little change of pace cool scenery and uh hunting further east than i typically do if anybody has any questions comments wants to let me know how their season's going leave a comment in the comment section down below if you guys aren't already subscribed to the channel you guys enjoy waterfowl content hunting and fishing videos be sure to click that subscribe button and notification bell so you guys don't miss out on any videos coming out soon uh, everybody hope everybody stays safe and thanks for watching